you're going to learn about how to add and use basic post effect lookup table and how to add text in your snap lens so let's get started okay so first you're going to type here base post effect lookup table click here and scroll down Now we're gonna open Lens Studio. So here we are. So first you have to tap on this color correction. You have to choose the empty one. Click here and add from here. Okay. So this is done. Okay. So till now we have learned about like how to download the base effect base post effect lookup table and how to just like upload it here okay in the lens project okay so now we want to learn about that how like what is this use of basic post effect lookup table and like how we can edit it okay so first of all i'm gonna open polo this is the photo editor okay so you can edit your base post effect lookup table okay and you can just add some filters in that okay from various photo editor it's your choice okay like you can add from pixart lightroom okay and polo etc okay so i'm now now using polo So yeah, some of the filters are here. I'm gonna add this one. Yeah. So yeah, now I'm gonna give you a like a very simple tip or a suggestion or a tip also. You can take it as yeah. So the tip is that that when you edit your base post effect lookup table, save it in the PNG format, not in GPG. Okay, because I have done it earlier as my mistake. I have uh, did it in JPG format and like it didn't work out. So always uh, save your base post effect lookup table in the PNG format. Okay, so let's move on. We will click it here and yeah, this one. Can you see the effect? Yeah. Before it was this, and now it is this. Yeah. Cool. So okay. So half of the uh, half of the tutorial is done, and the half of the tutorial was about how to use and add basic effect, base post effect lookup table. Yeah. So now we are gonna learn about how to add text in the snap lens. Okay. So we will use the same project only. So click on this add the screen text okay so you can see this okay so yeah so it's your wish totally that you have to add a like see there's a lot of choices here that you can add word date city date date and time display name display name that display name on your snapchat you have you can like display name month temperature time or whatever it's your choice okay so like if you want to write your name you can write like this yeah so i'm gonna insert day okay enter and here we go like time yeah 
so as you can see here is the day and here is the time fine so you can do it like this see just press the enter you can move it like this or back this okay so i added it yeah thank you here it is so now you i have like a choice that you can use the custom font okay so the snap uh, the lens studio has all, uh, also provided this fonts already you can use it from here or you can download any font file from google search it like uh, free fonts and you can just find many links from that you can download it and you can add it from here like i have one i have this one font like yeah i will open this here it is open and here the font is see the change yeah so there is the change here and you can increase oh sorry you can decrease and increase the font size as well and yeah here you can change the color you can choose the fill mode for color or texture it's your choice okay i will choose the orange color and we're going to have a drop shadow i hope this looks better and i want an outline too so it's this one here yeah. so yeah we are done about it okay and now the lens is made so let's publish it yeah so we going to type here that what we have in our lens like our lens is about day and time so i will write that only day and time like this is the lens icon which will show in your like like when you will open your lens in snapchat okay so you can add any image okay i'm just adding this image for this tutorial you can make a lens preview also okay and apply fine and yeah here yeah, i'm going to like to make preview i'm going to use another image this one this one is good yeah so i want my text to be down words like this like here okay fine yeah so it's done so now i will tell you that how to make a preview okay and in the next tutorial for sure i'm going to tell you like how you can upload like another images in this section fine like see this i have this image many more okay so i will tell you this in the next tutorial for sure and like basically adding images another from the provided ones like this okay so are we going to choose this one and we're going to record it it's done i'm going to save it like so the preview is done we have made it the preview and yeah everything is done let's publish the lens yeah so here we are submit new lens you can add up the tags you want like any tag like that day time is anything okay you can add the lens preview here is here yeah so there is a choice that you can just like choose any one of the three options like if you want your lens to be public like everyone can see it or hidden or offline it's your choice fine and let's submit the lens yeah it's been submitted congratulations celebrations <laughs> lord okay manage my lenses here we are so we gonna see like how much time it takes for that my lens gets public. Okay, you will see with me. Oh, 
okay like very fast okay so the lens is like is being public okay so you can all lose use this lenses and the tutorial is tutorial is going to end up here only okay so i hope you like this tutorial okay and if you like this tutorial you can tell down in the comment section and yeah if you want any of the like improvements in the next tutorial and what type of content you want in the next tutorial you can also comment down in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe the channel and don't forget to like the video and don't forget to press the bell icon for receiving the update for the next tutorial yeah so if you want to receive it don't forget to press the bell icon and here we are ending it ending this tutorial Thank you so much.